to toot our own horns around here, but we do have one of the best designers in the greater St. Louis area. This next segment has been sponsored by the Amory Design Studio, where she marches to her own drum, literally. We're talking about drum lights today, Amory. I know. I know. It's like the perfect play on words. I'm here for it. I know. I love that play on words. <laughs> Having drum lighting, that's like a just a fun way to say a light fixture, really. But it's about the shape, and it's about when you can use that kind of shape in a light fixture in the house. Well, it's not just acoustics as in like, you know, drums, <laughs> percussion. <laughs> well, how are these drum lights used when you're designing a space? Well, I like them. There's a lot of different styles. You'll see in some images that I've got here, but the idea is you can use them over a dining room table. You can use them in like up to the ceiling through hallways. You could use them against walls. There's all these really fun applications. You can have them. What's really cool is it, it's able to give you a lot of light output at one time because in the drum fixture itself, it hides quite a few light bulbs. Ooh. So I know that makes it so a little- So make it nice and bright. Right, nice and bright without staring at bulbs themselves. I like Great that. application right here. This is a flush mount fixture, so mm -hmm. it's up against the ceiling. It's over top of the sink. A lot of times you put a can light there or a mm -hmm. pendant hanging down. I like this application because it really makes that whole space glow mm -hmm. and a little piece of jewelry is hanging down down from I like that. that. Something subtle, but also sleek. Right, and it's soft. Like the light that comes out of that still is a really soft look and it's not jarring in any way. So mm -hmm. it doesn't take away if you wanted to have like chandeliers or something a little extra sparkly in a different area. I am a of, fan of this. Yeah, I, like I that absolutely too. am. Now, this is unique. Yep, this is a blend of metal and then like a frosted glass on the bottom. So this would be great for possibly a foyer if you don't want to have, you know, a big chunky piece in there, more contemporary or sleek, or a dining room table, or it could be over an island. Okay, so I like little that. clean lines. They have lots of diameters for mm -hmm. size to go from, and this is that fun matte brass finish. So that's a really piece of good piece of jewelry. And that's again. trendy right now too. Very. Trendy. Everybody loves this. Absolutely. Now this is like double the drum. Double drums. <laughs> <laughs> it's the, the snare and the bass. No. <laughs> but they, it's again like a fabric look around the outside. Mm -hmm. The bottom is probably a flush, uh, I mean a frosted glass on the okay. bottom of it itself. But you, you unscrew that little dot in the middle of that. That's how it comes down. You can replace the bulbs that way. Mm -hmm. But again, it's, it gives glow to the space. This is another version of what you just saw, but this has those fun bubbles of glass coming down. <laughs> Isn't it cute? That would totally so work in your house. Oh yeah, 100%. <laughs> but it's again a lot like what you saw at the sink in the other space. This is called a semi-flush. Okay. Notice how it comes down just a little bit from where the ceiling would be. The last one over the top of the island came down even farther. Like this one comes down a little this farther. This is gorgeous. You know, I love that one. That's like pieces of what looks like shells mm -hmm. ac around the outside edge of it. Now this one you could see up inside of and see the bulbs if you wanted to. Great for a living room space like mm -hmm. you'd see here or again over a dining room table. You could even do something like this in the foyer. It'll make a good glow but you're seeing the bulbs. Okay. Ooh, Here's I another like, one. This is different. I know. It's it kind of takes you back a little. It does. A little more traditional, mm -hmm. right? So the white and black, that contrasted look with the two finishes put together. And then look how many bulbs are in there. It's like one, two, three, four, is that five. six, five. eight? Yeah, I think there's eight Wowza. inside there. Which is tons of light output mm -hmm. again. So you're not getting glare with the bulbs hitting your eyes. Um, this is a, a, a unique look again. The whole drum above the table is what we're looking at on this one. It's that real dark metal finish. So you're not even getting glow from the outside. You're really just getting the light to shine straight down on that table. And if you notice, it's kind of in a angular shape coming down. So when it hits the table, it hits it on that good diameter of the space. I love all of these. I'm gonna just pause really quickly. Yeah. I mean, what is the feedback like when you recommend, you're, you know, you're putting on these final touches or these accessories, the jewelry that you like to describe them. Yeah. What is the feedback that you're getting from clients when it comes to these gorgeous drum lines? They love it. It's usually either that they like these for a lot of spaces in mm -hmm. their house or mm -hmm. it's just perfect for just that one application so that yeah. these other pieces that they have could really speak. Or mm -hmm. a lot of people really like lanterns right now. And the lantern Ooh. look is great for over an island, but then they might have a breakfast table nearby. Well, how do you do lanterns that are open and metally looking with something else next to it. They don't want to do the same exact look. A drum a light drum is, is that perfect. perfect in the middle place. Yes, it's okay. a good yeah. glow in that whole space. So I, I like really that. like to do that. I absolutely love that. Well, we're glowing yeah. today. We are absolutely laundry glowing. rooms too. I do a lot in laundry rooms because oh, it lets you get like four about bulbs that. inside a fixture, and it's a really cute look. I know it makes you actually want to go into the laundry room and fold some clothes. <laughs> 
Who doesn't? <laughs> or do laundry, you know. <laughs> right. You got to have some motivation. Yeah. Well, it's Tuesday, which means you always leave all of our viewers with a design tip. Yep. What is your tip today, Anne-Marie? March to the beat of your own drum. I love it. <laughs> it is March. We've got these beautiful drum lights. And if you are ready to spring into a new remodel, maybe it's your kitchen, the entire first floor, just a bathroom, something you definitely want to juge up, make it nice and beautiful, look no further than Anne-Marie and her entire team at the Anne Marie Design Studio. We'll make sure you have access to all of those details on how you can get in touch with them on our website at studiostl.tv. Don't go anywhere, St. Louis. We'll be right back after this quick break.